Nora Novak. Um, I'm a PhD student here and I'm from Germany. Hello, I'm Tobias Broderer. I'm a postdoc in this lab. I just started two weeks ago and I'm from Switzerland. Hi, I'm Pablo Sinues. I'm senior scientist and I am from Spain. Hi, my name is Martin. I'm a PhD student and I'm coming from Austria. My name is Lucas Bregge. I'm a PhD student and I'm Swiss. We all together are the breath analysis team in the research group of Professor Renato Zenobi at the Department of Chemistry and Applied Biosciences of ETH Zurich in Switzerland. In our lab, we are using an ABCX Triple Top 5600 Plus, which is a quadrupole time of flight mass spectrometer. It is a high resolution instrument and has MSMS capabilities. It was purchased in 2013 by one of our main collaborators at the University Hospital of Zurich to enable research in the team's core topic, breath analysis to identify disease-related biomarkers. We use it for classical LC MSMS analysis but in addition, we modified the instrument by replacing the standard electrospray ionization source by a commercial secondary electrospray ionization source from SEAM in Spain. In our group, we are working on the development of ambient ionization techniques for different applications. We perform real-time online analysis of exhaled breath to study biomarkers from people with lung diseases. Furthermore, we analyze breath from mice and humans who took medication to acquire dose response curves. In addition, we can measure volatile and semi-volatile organic compounds from virtually any source, like smoke from e-cigarettes or headspace from bacteria and cancer cell cultures. To demonstrate the capabilities of our mass spec, we would like to show a simple analysis to you where our instrument is used to recognize volatile organic compounds from different sources. My colleague Nora has drunk either apple or orange juice and we would like to know what she drank. Therefore, we made calibration measurements to identify two specific compounds. As we can see, time traces from two substances are shown. Two breath exhalations were recorded, one from a subject that consumed orange and another from one who drank apple juice. Each compound is dominantly present in the breath from the person who consumed one specific juice. Beta demestinone is more dominant in apple juice and limonene more dominant in orange juice, respectively. So let's analyze Nora's breath to find out what she drank. Please, Nora, exhale into the mask bag. We can now see the time traces from the specific compounds. And yes, we can recognize on the beta damastenone trace a more relevant signal. That means Nora drank apple juice. Did you? That's correct. We hope you enjoyed our video about our mass spec and the applications we are using it for. We wish you the best by using mass spectrometry to solve your problems and say goodbye.